Greenwaves. Welcome to Good Morning Greenwave. I'm Amanda Schlichter. And I'm Casey Wexler. Thanks for so much for tuning in this Thursday morning. Today is April 18th. We have a lot to get to this morning, but before we get to those stories, check out today's weather. For that, we go to Palmer. Thanks, Amanda. Now to our forecast. Right now it's 70 degrees in Fort Myers. There's no rain expected this morning under sunny skies. But as we move into the afternoon, it gets hot and sticky. There's an expected high of 89 degrees. It will be mostly cloudy with a 20% chance of rain. That's all for your forecast. Now back to the anchors. Palmer, now to our top story. The annual dodgeball tournament is today. Tons of teams ready to compete for the chance to dominate the competition. Make sure to go to the gym right after to get a good seat. Admission to watch the event is only three dollars. Three dollars. Well, again today, just go to the commons area during lunch. All fees and fines need to be paid before you can buy a ticket. Problem will be at Harborside Event Center on April 13th. The event runs from 8 until 11. This year, DJ Ramo G from 105.5 The Beat will be there. The end of the year is quickly approaching. That means it's time for Mr. Green Wave. Mr. Green Wave is a pageant for senior guys to show off their beauty, talent, and overall love for our school. The winner gets to hold the distinguished title of Mr. Green Wave. The event will be held on April 17th and is always a must-see. The show starts at 7 and admission is only $3. Good morning, Green Wave needs to take a quick break. When we return, Kirby has your sports news. We'll be right back. Good morning, sports fans, and I'm Kirby Wilhelm, and here is not my chest hair, but my school spirit. I'm here to show you the latest in sports news. Just a couple of quick notes to pass along to you. First of all, best of luck to our Lady Wave tennis team as they head to regional today. Also, the boys' tennis team concluded their season this past Wednesday. They lost a very hard-fought regional semifinal match against Naples High 4-3. The team looked to avenge their loss on Naples from earlier in the season, fell short in the seventh and deciding match. Please congratulate the guys for a great season. They are excited for next season when they look to defend their district title. Great job, guys. Finally, as you heard earlier, the dodgeball tournament is today. Get ready to witness perfect athleticism and head to the gym as soon as the last bell rings. It's all the sports news on this Thursday. Now back to the anchors. That's all the news we have for you today. I'm Amanda Schlichta. And I'm Casey Wexler. Stay classy, Fort Myers.